Hey guys, this tech tutorials here. The last video you saw was how to convert PNGs to icos. Now another YouTuber gave me another question and I like that and it was three most liked. So this was the question. Alright guys, so that was posted by IPT Boys. You can check out his channel in the description below. I'm going to show you how to make the Adobe CS3, CS4, CS5 icons. Now, first of all, open up Photoshop. And then Photoshop, a tutorial click File, on how to New, make a Photoshop icon using and make Photoshop. sure it, the width and the height are the same ratio. 500 by 500 will be good. Click OK. So it's a full square on your keyboard, all the backspace. Uh, I chose a darker green color. You could choose a darker red or whatever, darker blue. And then uh, just fill in the background. Now over here, filter, click on render, and then click on lightning effects. In light type, uh, click on omni, and just drag this up so there's like a semi arc over there. And you see these anchor points? You can drag it all the way down here so it has a kind of lightning effect, and it's not too dark here, it's not too light there. And then you click OK. Now it has a dark color there and circle uh, light color there. So uh, the text uh, size I'm going to use is 252, and the font I'm going to use Adobe Fan Haiti STD. Uh, you could get uh, you could use the same font as Marriott Pro. Uh, this is that comes with your system, but uh, Adobe Fan STD is way better. So I'm going to use that right now. So I'm going to type in uh, CS and make sure this is uh, well make sure you highlight this and make it a dark gray color so in the text below type in 2B 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 and click OK now it is a dark gray color the reason why it's a dark gray color because we need a uh, shadow inner glow Alright, so I just moved that, that down a little bit, and I am going to double click this, the uh, CS layer, or the text layer that you just made, and click on inner shadow, and it has a kind of inner shadow right there, and you can make the distance as however you want it to, I'm going to probably put it at 7, and the size I'm going to keep it as 5, and I'm going to move the angle around to 137 and I'm gonna click OK now there you go your uh, Photoshop uh, CS4 icon is done and now just save as PNG and just gonna rename it save it to my desktop alright so I'm gonna close this down so now you know how to make the, the Adobe Photoshop icon in Photoshop. Now I found this other thing if you do not want to take all that time and if you do not have Photoshop or do not know how to use it. Uh, I found this thing on the uh, Adobe website and it's called Icon Generator and it's made by Clockmaker. And uh, you can make your own 2.0 icons like 8.9. I can do that. or type in anything I want and this is how you make the original Adobe icons so I'm gonna type in CS well it's already typed in there I'm gonna type in uh, AE in this and I'm gonna make this a gray color like After Effects so now this looks exactly like that one except it's a little bit darker and all I have to do is create icon and I'll save it to desktop <clears throat> and it gives me all these other sizes so this size is 16 by 16, this is 32 by 32, 48 by 48, and last but not least, 128 by 128, which is like the same size as this. And these are very uh, unique icons. Now if you guys want to change an icon in your uh, application, uh, your programs, all you have to do is right click it, click on properties, and click on change icon. So I'm going to cancel that. and you need a dot ico file so follow this video on and the link here and it will be in the description below on how to make an ico image 
if this video helped please comment rate subscribe bye bye